guess I'd also like to thank um, the state of New Mexico for having my primary challenger be Mike Garrison in West Virginia. Once again, thank you for voting for that convicted felon. Um, yeah. So, thank you guys. I couldn't have done. I couldn't have done it without you. I couldn't have done it without all of the brilliant people over on the social networking sites. Um, and most importantly, I couldn't have done it while wearing pants. Okay, that may have crossed the line. Um, by the way, the line, I'm constantly moving it. I mean, I, I, I like to walk the line. I like to walk the line. I like to walk this sort of stuff, but no, that goes a bit too far. Um, so they had, so there's this blue phone box on campus, and what I was planning on doing today was going around and writing Bad Wolf on it, and then some guys started to do that before. It was really depressing. But I, so I decided, fine, I'll go to the police substation. And someone did it there too. And I don't mean that you, Mr. I was watching um, Two Broke Girls. I was watching the 12th episode. That's the one that stars Laura Spencer. And, it, and if you know her from Lizzie Bennet Diaries, she plays Jane Bennett and she plays this really nice person. And I thought that was really weird. And then I wanted to see whether or not she was angry at Two Broke Girls, like ostensibly the Two Broke Girls are. And then she was starring as a customer service representative. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, it's also laundry prom, and you can tell this because most of the people 
Anyway, that's my sign.